Welcome back. You are watching The Broker Life. My name's Steve. I'm the broker of Savvy Realty here in Las Vegas, Nevada. Uh, today I'm in Panorama Towers uh, looking at a special unit uh, that is a double O floor plan. It is one of the best units they have and most desirable in the building and I'll tell you why here in just a little bit. But if you do get uh, use out of these videos or that you find them helpful, please like and subscribe. It helps me out with YouTube's algorithm. But let's get back into the unit. This is a end cap unit. What that means is it's the end of the building at the far side of it. So with Panorama, when you're an end cap unit, you get both views. You, when you're searching for a unit, you're trying to find a strip view or you're trying to find a mountain view. This unit, you do not have to choose. You get both sides. Let me show you what I mean by that. Here, do do do. Oh, one, two, three. I gotta press my buttons correct for the cameras to spin around. Uh, so right now I am in the living room and this is the strip view side. So you get city center, you have Bellagio, and you have the 15 freeway right across from your view. MGM, Park MGM, New York, New York. And then if I go even further this way, Oh, you get the pyramids and uh, the Mandalay Bay. Let me go out and take, show you this. Oh man, you can't beat this view. This is the view that everybody wants when they come to Las Vegas. This is the beach. If you're going to the beach, you're moving there, you want the view of the ocean. This is our ocean view. And then next door is the Martin. And right now I'm in tower one of Panorama Towers and you can't see it on here, but there, uh, let me see the parking lot over there on that side. That's going to be Tower 2. So Panorama Tower 1 and Tower 2 are going to be mere images of each other, um, but just different, uh, different towers. Uh, you have the same gyms, the same um, uh, uh, amenities that come along with it, shall I say. Uh, but yeah, they are one of, and they were one of the most popular towers here in Las Vegas. Uh, because they were the first modern high-rise. Uh, Light Group actually created this. The founders of Light Group built these buildings. When they first were developed, of course, fully sold out originally. Um, all pre-construction too. So people didn't even know what they were buying. They were looking at pictures and this building completely sold out. But it's been a hit ever since. Let's go through the unit. We're gonna be at about actually 1560, 1582 square feet. Uh, it is a unique unit because it is a smaller, relatively smaller square footage at just under 1,600 square feet for Panorama Towers end cap size. Uh, this floor plan only goes up to, I want to say, the 14th floor in this tower, uh, and then it goes, balloons up the square footage to over 2,000 square feet, and the price points just jump astronomically as well. Uh, this unit is listed at 565,000. Uh, currently and of course uh, this video is going to be up for a long time so please double check our website all my information down below uh, in the contact information and in the description but uh, double check the website for accurate pricing for when you're watching this video uh, but yeah this is awesome I'm loving the open floor plan and that's what a lot of people like right we don't want to have a galley kitchen some other towers have these you know narrow kitchens that are in there but this is really open user friendly you can have your friends up at the bar area here and you know entertain right you are in Las Vegas this unit is made for entertaining uh, but let's head back over into the other side of the unit. Again, this is the end cap. So that was the front side, and we're going to the back side, which has the bedrooms in it. And we're going down this hallway here. This is actually our front door area, and then we do have our laundry and then extra storage as well. This unit is gonna be your air conditioner or air handler, uh, but let me show you what the laundry rooms look like. You have stackable washer and dryer, in every unit in Panorama Towers. Go. And storage is a big deal, right? Storage is a big deal in these units. You don't get a lot of storage, but this one ended up having some built-ins in this closet, which is really nice. It's not a huge, you know, uh, um, you know huge amount of storage, but for a high rise, it is. <laughs> a high rise here in Las Vegas, it's a good amount. I uh, thought this is gonna be bedroom number one, 
I'm sorry, bedroom number two, I guess. Then we got the, the master retreat just next door. Uh, Panorama does have, I mean, of course we have these interesting blinds here, but you do have windows that are operable. You can have fresh air coming into your unit. Um, over just across the street, over in, uh, what is it, uh, Veer Towers, there is no operable windows. So it's kind of a luxury to be able to have some fresh air. I love these doors on here too, How these sliding doors. Those are neat. Yeah, those are cool. And uh, here we go, head off over into the guest bathroom, which is right across the hall, not too far of a jaunt for you. Single vanity, and looks like our uh, mirror here or our uh, light fixture here is a little bit sideways. Oh, oh, it's a little bit heavy on the right side. <laughs> uh, this one just has a shower in it. You typically do not get a bath in your second uh, second restroom or second shower area. Uh, you will typically get a bath in the master if you're lucky enough to get it. Right, so heading off into the master. Oh. So this is the other side of your unit, the other end cap side. You have a balcony right off over here and just windows. You're a corner master suite here, right? Um, this, we got we're windows over here, windows over here, boom, boom, boom. It just keeps on going. Um, I would open these up, but currently the blinds are not working on this unit, but let's Let's try to step outside if we can. Whoa. Nice size patio. This is actually really big, right? For a high rise, it's not, not common to have a lot of space. And then right down below, you have your pool area. Your dog park is right here. Bam. And then when you do live here, you can walk right out these doors, walk straight to the back of this road, Hop on over where this gentleman's walking over here and you can go right into city center. It is quick and easy. I wanna say they used to say in the sales uh, sales office way back, okay, yeah, I'm aging myself because I know the people that originally sold these properties. <laughs> but way back when they would say it's 520 steps away from city center. So it's a quick walk. I've walked it myself many times. It can get a little bit warm. So one of the benefits of being in Panorama or in the Martin for that matter is having the, the car service that they have. They have uh, an Escalade for Panorama and you could hop in it as long as it's available and it's, you know, it's not like it's never available. It's actually pretty useful and I get a lot of clients that get a lot of use out of it. Uh, but hop in it, they'll take you to city center, they'll take you to Whole Foods down the, re down the road, they'll drop you at the airport. I mean, pretty much they say within three miles of the community is where they'll drop you off. So that is definitely a benefit for you. Oh, and again, one more time, if you are getting value out of this video, please like and subscribe. I do appreciate it. Now, let's get back to our tour. Here we go, going past the curtains. <laughs> so this uh, master bedroom has the same glass sliding doors as their, other, as their other bedroom over here. It looks like they put in a lower area as well for the closet. Typically, it's just gonna be this upper bar area here. Um, going into the master bath, I feel like it's a really good size master bathroom. You have, of course, the gorgeous floating tub over here and a dual vanity. Oh, it's so nice to see dual vanities and not being cramped for space. And again, space, you do have more storage right over here. And of course, your toilet. Dun! All right, but heading back out here, we're going through, you have your tub, loving the floating tub, and the, the water is actually coming out of the wall, which is kind of neat. And then your spacious glass enclosed shower over here. There we go, all tiled up, awesome. And this unit actually just had the renters vacate, so this is now not gonna be a rented unit, it's gonna be owned by uh, the next owner. I'm just selling it. We're gonna be closing here in probably the next few days. 
Um, but looking at the unit, awesome floor plan. This is, again, is a double O floor plan. So this is going to be the same floor plan as any other double O in the first tower, as long as you're below the, I believe the 14th floor, I'd have to double check that. Uh, but there is only a limited number of these units. It does not go all the way to the top like the other units. So rarity is definitely in the mix with this floor plan. But love it, it's a little bit larger. It's not too huge, so that kind of keeps your HOAs down. Your HOAs in this tower, for this floor plan, being at 1,082 square feet, you're at about 1,050 a month for Panorama, or for this floor plan in Panorama, right? So you gotta think about that. Having an end cap and also not having way high square footage, it keeps your HOAs in line. It's not too drastic. Oh man, love the balcony, love the view. I mean, you're sitting right here, look at, you're sitting in your couch right now, and you're taking a look at this, <laughs> this view. That's awesome. This is Vegas. That's exactly what you want. But again, my name's Steve. I'm the broker over at Savvy Realty here in Las Vegas. If you have any questions, please call or text me anytime or check out my website, Las Vegas High Rise condoliving.com. It's in the description. It has the most up-to-date inventory of anything here in Las Vegas. Everything is updated every 15 minutes. I will talk to you guys soon and have a great day. And I hope you enjoy this floor plan. Talk to you.